Hey, what's up, everyone? So, back with filming the 120 again. 120 community cichlid tank. Um, got me a couple new fish today at work. I had the boss man on the lookout for some geos. I kind of wanted some small baby ones, but he found these two guys. Let's see if I get a better angle. Here's one right here. This one right here. And there's his partner right there. And since they're decent size, I threw them up in this bad boy because it's a little bit too big because I did also pick up three other smaller ones and I got a couple other smaller ones coming on order uh, next week and begin next week, so and they're supposed to be smaller ones. But I just released these guys in here. They're already eating and fighting along with the other cichlids, but they seem to be holding their own. But, uh, yeah, I got some nice little geos for this tank. Um, from what I understand, they're the, um, what, the red-striped geophagus, earth eaters. So they will get decent size. Supposedly they're the ones that get around a foot. That's one reason why they're in here. And plus they are, as you see, they're, they're, they're decent sized cichlids. And they'll keep my sand nice and clean over here. But so far they're doing good. They've been getting messed with by some of the uh, smaller cichlids, like the fire mouth, finally seeing them. You can see that right now because I've been checking them out. But so far so good. I know it's still new and everything to them but uh we'll see how it goes hopefully it works out you know that's the community cichlid tank so but uh yeah the tank is uh it's hard to tell on this video it actually looks really good on this video but in person there is a lot of tannins in this uh tank right now it's kind of hard on this angle you kind of tell but with all that wood in there, but I like it. It's going to get nice and dark and look natural. And, you know, over time it'll come out with water changes. But for now, I'm really just rolling with it. I kind of like the look of it. It looks looks very cool. And that, oh, and that one piece of uh, driftwood finally sunk. I like how it, uh, I really like how this tank looks. It's one of my favorite tanks right now. But I thought I would show you guys a little update and new fish. Got this two geophagus. Unfortunately, um, I didn't film this or nothing, but if you guys look, you can notice there is a fish missing out of this tank. My um, Vieja unfortunately jumped out, and um, that sucks. But yeah, but I, I did get those two new guys. I hope they work out. They look to be doing well so far. They're right there. I figured they would stick towards more towards the sand until they, unless they got picked on, then they'd probably find a spot somewhere up in there. That's why I, I did this tank like this, because if the cichlid does get picked on too much, the smaller ones, they could find plenty of hiding places. But I hope you guys enjoyed this little video. Like, share, and subscribe, and have a good day.